The template column creates labels, or messages based on other columns in our table. We define a template and replace certain words with text from the other columns in our table. For example, here we have the phrase, hello, name. We've written the word name in capitals just to make it clear that it's our template word, but it's not required. Now, in our template column, we can replace that word, name, with the text in our name column. Now, every row has the phrase hello and then that person's name. Let's start by defining the template within the column's text box. In the background, we can see that we have three columns that define information about people. Let's create a new template column called About, which will combine all of these together into a sentence. Let's write the phrase name is age and lives in location. Again, the capitalized words here are just to make it clear to us which words we intend to replace. We can actually replace any type of text, numbers, or symbols. Now underneath, we can start defining our replacements. I'll replace name with the text in the name column, age with the age column, and location with the location column. Now we have a unique about text generated for each person. We might, however, wish to define our template so that we can edit it within the app itself. Here we see an example of a returns policy that is applied to each list item. On the second tab of this app is an area where we can update this template. When we update the template here, it applies to all list items. To set this up, we choose a location in our table where we'll define our master template text. And we make sure that this is connected to an editable text component in our app. Next, we create a single value column that copies that cell to all rows in our table. We then create a new template column and choose that column as the source. Now we can always update our returns policy without needing to go to our table. To learn more, visit glideapps.com learn.